We have updated information on an evacuation in Clinton last night. Last night, 96 people were evacuated from an apartment building in Clinton. This after the third floor ceilings in their apartment building collapsed. The construction company responsible for the roofing project was back today to start repairs. News 10's Patsy Kelly has more about the possible repercussions of last night's events. The heavy rains in Clinton could have had devastating results for Clinton Chateau residents. You could have ceilings fall on top of people while they're sleeping or worst case situation could have had a fire that could have been start, started from the electrical outlets being wet. Workers installed a cover over the working apartment roofing project, but with the heavy rain last night, it didn't hold. Just had a large amount of the roof that was open only covered with tar paper for the evening. Several of the rooms sustained complete ceiling uh, fell down and then with the rest of water moisture being in there, I would say a lot of it's going to be pulled just to prevent mold and any mildew. Clinton Fire Chief Chris Strom says with water leaking into the drywall and electrical outlets, the night's episode could have been debilitating. The rainwater that collapsed the supposed barrier seeped all the way down into the second floor. Officials shut off the power and evacuated the residents to a nearby church. But Chief Strom says the consequences could have been worse than a mere inconvenience. I mean, this could have definitely ended in a very, very traumatic incident with loss of life and a lot further loss of property. In Clinton, Patsy Kelly, News 10. Chief Strom says the company is hoping to start moving residents back in. The company told the chief the new paper they were using as a cover was faulty.